Hello and welcome back to Massive Chalice if you're truly lost and really mad. It's time to try and defend the keep of House Iron Hand. Who are you? Oh, Darren Tarantino. Oh, okay. I, I should have expected that, really. Can you come along? We only have one Iron Hand. The sister is in this. But that should be enough. Maybe. Lots of alchemists. Primarily just alchemists and... Only one of them is a boom striker. The other two are actually just alchemists because of the... Death of one. Tarantino. Very well, uh, let's just head on in. It's a fine day for battle, all things considered. Every day is a fine day for battle. Indeed. Oh, do I only have these five troops? I was assuming that I would also be able to move for the regent end. Or is this just in the field and not an actual keep attack? Oh, well, in that case, we're not in nearly as much trouble as I was expecting. Alright. Can you hide anywhere? I'm gonna move the alchemists together. For now. Though... I will require that the... Scouty ones actually locate... You know, figure out what's going on before anything else happens. Impressionable? What happened to you? Details. I have no idea what... Or did someone else... Did someone else have impress impressionable? Did, do you have impressionable? Yes, so you got faint-hearted from someone else. And maybe tranquil. What a pleasure. Can you run over there? That must be a cradle. Ugh, cradles. Just get in there and take them out quickly. Unless you're interested in seeing the joys of childbirth. And what a joy it is. But make sure your blows count. Well, there's also rupture over there, so we can't actually... <sighs> is there anywhere for this guy to run? Okay. Then the alchemists will continue on standby for now. The cradle hasn't yet to notice the battle. Which is how, just how we like it. Kill him. Uh, okay, you? Nicole, wait, how much XP do you have? You both don't have a lot. Alright, well, move over here and kill him. That's not how you kill him, but good effort then, nonetheless. But in this case, we probably can afford to throw this as well. What is you? What is with them all failing their little uh, free throw? Why do they do that? It's silly. Okay, take a look over there. Make sure there isn't anyone else behind the cradle. But then we need to see if we can take him out quietly. Nope, oh, nope. I'm sorry, but you must keep going. Wow. Don't give the enemy another chance. Clearly. I forgot about the part where it actually knocks him back as well. You need to get in really close. Do 
This is not good. Though the stun will help. The stun should certainly help. I'm gonna go over there. A rupture. Shit. Well... Can you reach him? This turn? You can, okay. More ruptures. Even better. We can't afford to worry about that right now. We need to kill this guy. Which is not going to be easy, I don't think. And we won't have stun available this turn. Which is pretty shit. Yep. No. Well, the rupture might deal damage to that guy as well. Nope. Brand cannot. Or the Gaber. Now we have seeds coming in. More seeds coming in. And I thought we were going to be prepared for this, you know? Well, uh, the obvious choice here is this. Oh, you have a precision one. That might work. That did work. Quite indeed. That worked pretty well for our little... Oh, you missed. Right, that was the free strike as well. Okay, you two are not standing good. Try to kill him. Excellent. Oh, and... Did it just spawn more seeds? It just spawned seeds. Kill one. Get the show on the road. And we still don't know half the map. Let's just hope the rest are classic blows as well. There's no way anyone will die this turn. Unless a cradle pops up from nowhere. But there might be a chance that one of these people is going to have to drink a potion. Why did you do a classic blow? Dude. That you're better than that. Alright, and you get a kill as well. And you, you don't get a kill. Alright, uh... Move out of the immediate battle area and drink up. Thank you. You? Wait, level 4? Dara the Mist Tarantino and Muriel Ironhand is still level 3. Ooh, you get a new ability, don't you? Nice. What is it? Excess not to carry items. Light to streamlight flasks that can be thrown much farther than normal. Ooh. Two potions sounds good, eh? But I don't think you get that this round. Okay, don't walk in the goo. Just punch him. Alright. Now what? <laughs> we have no idea where the enemy might be. There still is no overwatch, so I don't even know what. Keep trying that. We are apparently seeing. We cannot stealth at this moment. That's... I can't say I'm a fan of that. Okay, we, we can stealth from here. Which means that whoever is seeing us was seeing us from that side, so... Uh, if you can also back off over here, we can wait them out. 
I think. Yeah. Give it a try. Everyone should be in cover. Oh, it was the rock shit that spotted us. What did Impressionable do for you this time? Alert! Increase the range in against range attacks. That sounds pretty handy, to be honest. Alright. Two ruptures. Okay, less fun of that fan of that, but you know. Should be able to get this kill, no problem. So that will mean you will be low on flasks for the future. Hmm. Let's stealth over here, just in case. And then, if we walk here... Can we go over there? No, just out of range. Bugger. Step back then. And let the rupture come to us. Luckily from far enough away that it doesn't really affect much. You should be able to take this kill now. Those precision flasks are really useful actually. Assuming you actually get the people close enough together for it to work well. Okay, that's not in poisonous corrosive goo, so go check it out. Yeah. Uh, you can step over here. And you can follow in her footsteps. Alright. Now let's see. Where do we have a cover? Absolutely nowhere. That's a pleasure. What's this then if it's not cover? Or why was it showing up is the question. Can we move anywhere towards here? No. Of course not. But can you walk over there? Can you reach that? You can't. Okay, in that case don't do anything. We'll just walk on by to the side. Outside of goo, because we don't want to be in goo. Big surprise to everyone. Ah, well, he's gonna have to move. But that's gonna be an option, so go ahead. And you get another kill. <laughs> I see my advice is paying off. Your advice? Did he advise us to breed those two together? I don't remember. Oh look, it's spaceship! Wait, no, this is not XCOM. Uh, okay, the seed... ...over there. Let me step back a little. Just in case. But the seed did not follow us, so... That's... Kind of surprising, really. Okay, let's go back and uh, send the boobs, well, the Gaber in first for when we actually try to encounter the seed. But we don't know if they can reach over here. Because if they can't, well, I'm not trying to reach them either. Oh no, that was in range. Just gonna have to heal. Oh, did I place in corrosive? Oh. Right, it used to be a safe place to stand. It was no longer that. Flanking blow, really? Even with these flanks? Okay, you give it a try. Good job, little Tarantino. Okay, okay, you heal yourself. Because that's a good idea at the moment. We need the Iron Hand to level up. A le oh shit. Can you hit that? Actually, yes, yes, you can. 
Advance. And do a double strike on that. Come on. Oh yeah. Can you reach that? You can. But then we'll have to just uh, go the classic way of stunning the bastard. Low risk play there, but you know. He's going to burst into a million of seeds anyway. And on that note, two other seeds appeared. Okay. Uh, whom do I send to finish him? Fucking seeds. Alright. Does that work? But good for you, little bugger. Your advice? Once once again his advice is paying off. But apparently we're still not certain if it's his advice or someone else's. Or hers, I guess. Yeah. No one else is giving advice. Just those two. Ah, we're out all out of flasks now. So uh, let's stay together. See what we can do about this. Oh, did you level up? Congratulations, level three, little Tarantino. Ruptures. Oh, did you see the way that one went down? It had to be ruptures. Someone else would have gotten it wrong. Fucking hell. And it's only Derek that's in range of them. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. We're gonna move him closer anyway. That's for sure. Her. May as well move her a little. Is there a way to get more flasks? Because flasks are like the primary thing. Oh wow. That would be really good for her, her flasks and stuff. Mad Bomber is the last one. Level 10. Look at the current situation, I am not entirely certain we'll reach that, but. We stand a better chance than we have previously stood. Seriously, 4 damage. What are you? Seed? This might be enough to save the little bugger. Derek. His name is not Little Bugger, his name is Derek. He is open. The corrosion should not be enough. Yeah. We have in fact survived this. Can we get a level from this? Probably not. But there we go. Good work. Remember the four we won. Let's carry on. We actually won. And we have two level four people now. Dara the Mess Tarantino and the Muriel Ironhand. Though I really don't know what's going to happen in the future now, because... Oh, we're almost to the point where our new heroes should arrive. I think I'm gonna go with Rebound again. Uh, Tarantino the Mess Tarantino... Dara the Mess Tarantino, I mean. Uh, I think... She's gonna get to level 5. Uh huh. Quite sure of that. I'm a real fan of that. It's like. Excitement! Yeah, wait. I wanted to check tra trainees. That's what I wanted to do. H10, 9, 5, 12, 9. Yeah, we should be good. We should get some more heroes soon enough. So it's always a shame when we lose another one. Two members of House Tarantino have fallen. Two! Any witty commentary? No? Chalice! Chalice! Okay. A dark falcon arrives with a few short messages from Rowena Carriva. At first I could see the shapes of old keeps and towns rising out, rising out like islands, but now there's nothing. The corruption is an endless tide washing everything away. 
So a bird then, that was something. Okay. Oh. When is she going to get back? In five years. Five years. Ah, and we have more people. An alchemist, a hunter. They're all level one though. Which is probably what the uh, this is for. Recruitment boost. Ooh, haste hooch, bonks, sponge stone, birdus core. We can have a ramp cap caper. Mm, that's so good. On the other hand, it's... We could get a key... Crucible. Yeah, that's what I want. The Crucible. But on the other hand, this is so good. Yeah. We're gonna use up some cables. Can we put anyone in the Sage Rights Guild? Dara the Master Antina has an intuition of 10. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, I don't really think I actually want to sacrifice anyone to these guys right now. Because, you know, we don't have a lot of people. We've got something for you. I doubt it's something you'll expect. A doctor brought you awake. Excuse me, a region ship yours, Crystal Iron Hand and Munor Ficaro were visiting the capital today and during the tour of the gardens, Crystal went into labor. We've been trying to deliver the baby, but there have been complications. I can't say both of them, and when I told Moon of this, he ran out of the room. I don't know who else to ask. Uh, attempt to save the mother. Crystal is important to us. Alright. The surgery goes off as well as can be expected. Moon of greets uh, Crystal upon waking and promises that they will try again. <laughs> they will try again. It's a good thing that they will try again, but... I lost the puppy. But I really don't want to lose Crystal. We named an episode after her. We can't save her. She rose to be a hero of the nation and then a regent. She must live on. Oh, she's sickly. I didn't know that. I think that might be from the recent event though. Quite possibly. Carry on, time. I think we might actually reach year 100. Oh. A familiar balloon drifts into the capital's courtyard with a stone faced Ravina Gariva still in tow. Ravina jumps out and refuses to say anything more to you than we're on our own. I said it wouldn't be like anything you've ever seen, the old man laughs as the local town gains another patron. Ravina? Oh, Raven Iron Hand. Starts out at level 3, that's perfect, valid. It? It's really nice, actually. Okay, Rina is our oldest gaber. Increased intelligence from travels, decreased intuition from tra travels. Wait, what? Uh, would she work well for SH right? No, intuition of 4. No, that, that doesn't really help. We do need to put someone in there eventually. But I want the Tara to be... Someone to defend. We should actually try to defend this one at some point. Bulwarks, wrinkles and lapses. Yeah, in this case I think this is a better option to defend. The bulwarks and cradles. And seeds. Oh. oh. We have two level 4s there, so we might have a chance, though we still don't have ramp caps. Oh, very well. Anyway, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.